Hello and uh, welcome to my gear channel or could even be my landscape channel. I just wanted to re-review my tripod after having it for 18 months, maybe two years, maybe even longer than that. I can't remember when uh, Sunway Photo actually sent this over to me. Um, I just wanted to do a my review on it really now uh, i gave you my thoughts when i first got it and absolutely loved it this now the t3650 cm amazing i can't say much more about it apart from it's absolutely amazing i haven't had a single thing wrong with this tripod since the day i started using it and abusing it and treating it rough and ready this gets banged around it gets extended out i'm out with the legs i'm in with the legs i'm stretching the legs i'm putting the legs back down again i'm going up to maximum height i'm coming back down it goes in water it's been in the sea today you know it's been in everything and i don't wash it often i give it a rinse down every so often and it is absolutely it's brilliant it's, it's it's really stood the test of time one of the things i had trouble with my benro and i don't get me wrong i love my big giant benro tripod it's just a little bit big to carry around now um, is the rubber grips started to twist on their own so i'd lock it off and they'd twist or I'd get it up tight and i can't undo it because they're twisting great benro sent me some new ones and i replaced them fantastic but this has not come loose at all these grips are still solid there is no movement in whatsoever the water sealing that they promised you when you buy this it's got a, a seal inside these in these threads you don't get any sand salt grit or anything like that in them it doesn't let any water in it is true it doesn't i've had no sand in these i've had not cleaned these threads once in the last two years i've had no water fill up inside this tripod and again my benro as much as i love that tripod if you leave it in water for long enough it will fill up inside the tube and then you have to take the the, the, the foot off and let the water out this does not do that it is brilliant it is water sealed i've had to change the spikes on the bottom the spikes that come with it are a little bit too short so i wanted slightly longer spikes and i've got these nice 55 millimeter spikes they're aluminium as well so they're a little bit lighter absolutely amazing if you want to know where to get them drop me a line in the comment and i'll tell you exactly where to get them from i've paired this tripod up with the uh, gh pro 2 geared head amazing now the tripod on its own i've got some notes here the tripod on its own weighs 2.1 kilos and the geared head is 700 and 671 grams so it does make the weight a little bit heavier but this geared head i've really fallen in love with it and i've got to say that the gh2 pro is fantastic um, i really do like it a lot of people seem to be going to geared heads now i've grown to like this and it's really really good i have changed the top on it i've put a quick release uh, clamp top on it um, but other than that it's fantastic the new version comes with a full pano head which i've shown in one of my reviews as well also attached to this as you've seen me using many times is my osmo mount which is normally mounted to this this is the small rig mount it's a nine inch one uh, or could be the 11 inch one and i've also got the ulanzi quick release hummingbird clips on the top so with this paired to this it's absolutely amazing there's a thread in the side that makes it work also some way done an up some way photo done an upgrade and did the uh, half ball head so you can get the half ball head now and you can tizzle it around and you can get the panos exactly level you can tripod is a bob on now if you do buy another tripod say you want a big heavyweight and a lightweight and i've got a lightweight coming up very very soon they've just sent me the new of the new version of uh, the slightly smaller version of this uh, i can't remember the numbers i think it's a t246 something like that or i'll put it on the screen for you but i will be doing a full review on it and i'm going to look at it all the legs work fine all the buttons are working fine everything is clicking into place there is no rust there is no corrosion there is nothing wrong with this tripod that i can see whatsoever the bubble is still clear and still works all the threads are still clear none of this is rusted up and i've had this near the sea i've had it in sea spray and all sorts and there is nothing wrong with this tripod so i do highly recommend this uh, after having it for such a long time um, i'm going to give you some quick dimensions you've got these um, carbon fiber top the top is 36 mil and the bottom section is 22 so it's quite a chunky tripod i've also added one of the sunway photo warm grips um, i've got three of them you can go on each leg but when it's really really cold it's just something nice to get hold of on that warm grip um, the leg height is 52 centimeters folded up so it's quite a small compact tripod it fits in my bag really really well whereas the benro used to stick up in the air quite a long way uh, leg height extended is 160 centimeters so you're nearly six foot um, nearly six foot high it's got a platform at 81 millimeters that's on the top there which we know about and we've told you before it take a low capacity of 25 kilograms more than enough for anything i'm ever going to put on top of this it is solid as a rock and when you dig it into the ground with them spikes perfect 
Um, the leg angles will go 23 degrees, 55 degrees and 85 degrees. So that's the tripod, I do recommend it. You can now get these in the UK. I have a supplier in London who takes full stock of the Sunway Photo gear, um, quite a lot of gear, and he will be getting bigger and bigger stocks as he moves on. It's only happened in the last few months because we needed to get the Sunway st Photo stuff over into the UK and he is now supplying direct from him in London. If you're interested in anything, drop me a comment. I've already had three people ask and they've already got one guy's purchased one of these and the head all ready and he is buzzing with it turning up he's really really happy uh, as for the geared head if you want to know anything about that it is a t6061 aluminium material um, it's a clamp type it's got a clamp type ddh11 that's the clamp that i had put on the top but i've removed uh, dimensions 140 84 by 121 and it'll take a low capacity of four kilograms so this will only take four kilograms and the tripod will take 25 but again there's not many things that weigh more than four kilograms that you wouldn't be worried about putting on the top there so yeah absolutely love it highly recommend it again if you're interested in anything from Sunway Photo give us a shout I will contact John straight away for you and uh, yeah he'll send you an invoice and a price so that's all I wanted to do run through my my thoughts on this and I'm honest to god it really is as good as it is the day I say I got it and I can't fault it highly recommended ciao for now see you soon bye bye